Hi guys and welcome to your next weekly general reading with Aesthetics Flow. So this reading is from the 27th of May to June 2nd, so the rest of May and the start of June. As you can see, pretty much all five cards, so <laughs> this is going to be a very interesting reading. So the first one is Four of Fire, second card, Three of Fire. And then we've got a Major Arcana Balance, number 14. And then we have Eight of Fire. And it's so interesting as there's another Fire card underneath this one, the Seven. So we've got a Three and a Four and a Seven and an Eight. Wow. Oh, they're taking it back from all this. Okay. So let's start on the Fire element to begin with. So Fire actually... It is a lot of energy. The, this means there is so much energy around you at the moment and there's a lot happening. But fire is transformation. It means change, like deep change, but also you have the power of fire with you right now, which is the power of alchemy. As fire, when it touches anything, it changes whatever the object is. I know it incinerates it, but it's like the phoenix. It's reborn from the ashes. So. I feel like almost there's been a rebirth with you somehow and I'm feeling that whatever's changed with you, I don't know if there's a belief you've let go of or a job you let go of or you've moved on, moved countries, moved towns, I don't know. There's something with you that has forever changed and will never be the same again. It's like the fire has incinerated it and it's no longer there because you realize you didn't need any more it was a part of your old self your old ideals and belief systems and whatever it is there is something old here that has died that's what i actually really feel like here something old has died and never to be seen again and now it's like you're the phoenix and you're rising from the ashes and it's becoming you've actually become a new version of you. I know there's been a massive spiritual enlightenment and we've been going through it for the past few months but there is something here that's happened in the previous week here that has you've changed your mind about something, your perception, you've you're working things out now, you're thinking things through differently and it's changed your outer world because I know there's somebody that came in last week so I don't know if they've been the shift with you that's changed something within you but something within you has changed forever that's what I want to say and now we have this new energy around us and we've got this like power almost like every, everything we touch right now is manifesting everything we think we're thinking about is manifesting now you have this deep power within you that you've discovered and now it's like you've worked out how to use it which is which is amazing it's absolutely amazing and I feel like here too I don't know about you guys but I've been seeing the number two everywhere <laughs> Absolutely everywhere and we've got a three and a four here and a seven and an eight So I'm kind of counting that as twos in its own way like its own little pairing So I kind of feel like and we've got the balance card here There's been a union a pairing of some sort which I kind of saw last week So I don't know if it solidifies this week or It's you pairing with this new energy you figuring out how to which I feel like you have but maybe there's still some workings out there, but balancing this new energy and this new platform, you know, this new level you've risen to, it's finding, it's like a pairing there almost, it's like you're pairing yourself with this energy and it's you learning how to balance this energy and use it because when you tap into this, you're literally infinite, you're, it's like magic and I think you're figuring out how to work this out and balance it within your new life and not let it overwhelm you because it can be quite overwhelming you're figuring out how to implement this into your life this new thing you've worked out within yourself this new level you're at you're working out how to bring it down and how to use it wisely and use it in your new reality whatever you're working on now and this has brought a lot of peace for you whatever this is that's happened you feel like a deep inner peace with it which is really beautiful to see it's um you feel quite content with it and also, now is the time here, because you're feeling quite abundant with this energy. It's not necessarily abundance in the outer world. It could be. You could have, you know, received a lot of money, I don't know, like, or a promotion or something, which, you know, gives you a lot more money. And I feel like with this, the abundance is more in the energy field now, and you feel abundant with yourself, if that sort of makes sense. And 
this is the best currency you can use right now is this energy and I think you've worked that out it's like materialism's kind of I feel like it's kind of left you really I feel like you've had a deep disconnect with the material world and it's more your spiritual world that you're focusing on and that's what's feeling wealthy to you right now which is really beautiful to see actually it's like there's been a stepping process with this too you've gone through this change quite well it hasn't been um, painful I feel like this has been a real peaceful kind of shift whatever happens here whatever has happened to you and it's either you need to seek this balance which I think you're working that out but I feel like almost this is a significant thing just saying you found the balance that's what I want to actually say you found a new balance within yourself the new pairing within yourself with this energy and you this new connection and that's why you're feeling a lot of peace there will be things moving quite fast around you because fire, you know, comes in like lightning. So I feel like there is a lot of um, change happening around you and a lot of energy happening around you. But I don't know, I just want to say, I feel like you're not being touched by it. I feel like you're like the eye of the storm, like the eye of the tornado. You're all calm. It's like everything's happening around you, but you're not letting it affect you anymore. It's like you've worked something out, you've worked it out kind of thing. Like it's like the high priestess or the queen card. I can't remember which one it is. But when they come down here, they know exactly how to manifest. They know exactly how to work this world and this matrix. So you benefit and you grow out of it. And you're not being affected by all the negativity. I feel like there's been a deep understanding and a deep letting go within yourself. It's like all those things that used to worry you don't worry you anymore. It's really awesome, actually. And stand your ground with this. Don't let others tell you how to do it you've already worked it out you've already worked this out so you don't need anyone to tell you what's what's best for you that's what I would feel like I want to say there are always people around you that try and bring you down to their level don't let them affect you I feel like you're not anyone I don't even feel like I really need to say that to you it's just you're having these people around you having their little opinions and all that but it's just like nothing's affecting you nothing's touching you yeah there's been a deep, the moon card here, it's deep psychic intuition, it's deep um, understanding and everything's happened below the surface. So this has all happened within you, all this change that's happened here, it's happened within you and you found this balance. There's a lot of fours here as well because you times, you know, four plus four equals eight and then we've got the 18 here and they've got the 14 so plus four. So there's a lot of fours here too and that's another symbol of balance you found your balance here this is really awesome to say I feel like there's just this realization and it's just you've worked it out this is this is a very internal week here and I feel like it's a week of just pairing yourself with this I feel like you have found the balance but there may be a little bit more pairing with this energy as you settle this into your reality but you found a real inner calm I just feel so calm reading this at the moment this is a very beautiful week and everything's happening underneath the surface well, anyway, that's all I need to say. I hope this has helped you guys. And if you want to, you can follow me on my channel. Please subscribe. And also on Instagram, if you DM me, um, if you'd like a personal reading, just at tiny.langshaw. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you next week.